Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick. We are back on Yu-Gi-Oh! Legacy of the Duelist. We're going to be doing the Arc V, the one ca uh, campaign mission, um, and then I'm going to be getting the uh, Pendulum Summon achievement, so we'll go and play a quick duel against someone. Um, I have the Pendulum Structure deck, so I'm just going to go ahead and use that, since I really don't know how to build a proper deck using Pendulum Summoning. Uh, so, it's just how I'm going to go about it. I just need to do one Pendulum Summon. I do need to pay attention in this tutorial because I don't know how to do Pendulum Summons. I uh, could probably find a better tutorial just online on how to do effective and good Pendulum Summons, but I'll let the game take it take it, uh, and let them do the little tutorial because um, I'm not going to be using Pendulum Summons, but let's see here. First, we will show you how, to pen how Pendulum sum or Pendulum Cards work. These cards are, can be played as either monster cards or spell cards. Once you play two pendulum monster cards as spells in the pendulum zones, you can perform a special pendulum summon. Let's look at the pendulum cards as they have a lot of information on them. Since they do so much, they have two effect text boxes on them, depending on how they are played. If you activate your pendulum card as a spell in the pendulum zone, it stays on the field and you can use, it, use its pendulum effect written on the top of the box. You can also summon or set a Pendulum Monster card as a monster. It, this is done by placing it in a monster zone and using its monster effect in the bottom box. Another advantage of Pendulum Monsters is that instead of being sent to the graveyard like normal monsters, they are placed face up in your extra deck instead. This is true if the Pendulum Monster card was played as either a spell card or as a monster. Now we will show you how, to pen, how a Pendulum Summon works. Alright, good. Whoa, you have four Pendulum cards in your hand. Let's get the most out of these Pendulum Monsters. Since they do so much, they have two effect text boxes on them depending on how they are played. These cards are played in the Pendulum Zones. Didn't they just tell you this? Let's begin a Pendulum Summon. First place Dragon Horn Hunter in the left Pendulum Zone. Okay, now place Flash Knight in the right Pendulum Zone. You can Pendulum Summon once per turn during your main phase. Each Pendulum card has a Pendulum Scale indicated by a number between the red and blue arrows. Uh, in the card description, one in one Pendulum Summon you can summon as many monsters as you want from your hand, or from face-up Pendulum Monster cards in your extra deck. However, the level of the monsters you Pendulum Summon has to be in between the scales you have in the Pendulum Zones. You can now summon monsters that are between level 3 and 7. To do so, select Pendulum Summon from a Pendulum card. Okay. Uh, pendulum Summon Sacred Crane, uh, Foul Cult Cannon, and Lesson... I'm not even going to try to say that. What's happening? Okay. This is kind of cool. Kind of weird. Okay. Alright. So, pretty much swarm the field. The ability of Sacred Crane allows you to draw a card. You can still normal summon this turn, or the turn you pendulum summon. Tribute Foul Cult Cannon to summon t Tongue Twister in attack mode. Uh, why would I do this? What is the point? Um, okay. I don't really know what we're doing here. What the heck is... Also notice that Dragon Horn Hunter's Pendulum Effect gives Lace Lansinfori Genchis a 200 attack per boost. End my turn. Okay. This Lansinfori Genchis is like the best... It's the, uh, it's the best Pendulum Monster- looking Pendulum Monster I've seen. The heck is he doing? What the- Really? 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 Okay, what are we doing now? 
Whoa, your opponent really wiped out your monsters. Let's Pendulum Summon to bring some of them back. You can Pendulum Summon from the extra deck and the hand at the same time. Okay. I'm not really sure how I'm going to win this. Okay, Falcout's Cannon. This is weird. This is weird. Pendulum summoning is weird. I'll activate Fissure. Activate Pond or Pound or Bound Wand. I can't read. Okay. Do we? I guess we do. Guess the one guy boosts the other attack points. So, all right, that works out. Okay, tutorial mission complete. Gong strong, going strong, deck recipe, challenge deck, gaze of odd eyes, deck recipe, performable curtain call, Guilford, eggs of despair, soul devouring bamboo sword, the victory dual points. All right, so let's go ahead and back out here. Um, we want to do a duelist challenge, and let's go ahead. Let's go ahead and just beat. I'm trying to think of who's probably got the. I'm just gonna go. Well, let's just beat Weevil. Pendulum structure deck. Let's go ahead and see if I can get this W. This could take. This could end up taking longer than I uh, than I think, but we'll see. We'll find. We'll find out. Ah, screw you, Weevil. You suck, Weevil. This is going to be, I don't want to say rough, but it, it's going to be kind of annoying to try to get these cards on the field. Alright, let's do this. Let's go ahead. Let me set that card there, I guess. So, or do I should have waited? Should I wait it and put it there? I don't even, I don't know. Oh. I, okay, well. Well, this is... To be honest, this is starting out pathetically. My bad. Is my bad. This could take me a few duels. Oh, that's cute, Weevil. Playing in sectors. Sure. Yeah. Um, 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 see this isn't helping, I need to draw pendulum monsters. Maybe I should just build a deck with a crap ton of pendulum monsters so I can do this. Just build a deck of 40, pe that would allow me to pendulum summon at least. I would know that I could pendulum summon. Sector ear wing. Well, I think I done screwed this up pretty pretty badly. Okay, I need. Hold on. We're, let's create. Let's create a deck with just a ton of pendulum monsters. Let's do. Let's go about this that way. back out. I was trying to look up something about this, but we just, we'll just go about it this way. Hold on. I have a, I have a strategy. Okay, now. Okay, hold on. I need card frame. Is this gonna, no. No, type. I think this is how. No. Nope, that's not how. Number of cards. Is it card? It is card frame. Okay. But see, 
I do have a ton of pendulum monsters already. Not a ton, I guess, but I have some. So we're just gonna do this. Hopefully this is not a horrible idea. I just want to get the Pendulum Summon achievement, I'm not really going for anything else. So now, actually, let's go by name. Um, and now I just want card drawing cards. So we need peas, pea, pots, pot, 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 pot. Um, pendulum Shift? I'm not gonna mess with that, where's pot? Pot. Pot of Greed, Pot of Duality, um, Card Destruction, uh, where is Card Destruction? There it is. Okay, um, and then, let's see here, Magical Mallet, um, um, magical mallet. Where is magic? Magical mallet. I need magical mallet. Or whatever. What is it called? It's called magical mallet, isn't it? Yeah, here we go. Okay, I got two of those. What else? Graceful charity. G. G R. Where's graceful? No, oh, G R. What am I doing? I can't spell. Um, where is Graceful Charity? I have more G R cards than I thought. The heck? I'm not seeing it. G Gray. Oh, there it is. Graceful Charity. Now, what else do I want to throw on this deck? So I guess Swords of Revealing Light's not a bad idea. Let's go for swords. Now, let's go with Nightmare Steel Cage. This is the stupidest deck. You're not going to win Jack Diddley Squat with this deck, but... But... Where is it? Oh, I'm in the P's now. Why am I not... Why am I not in the ends? Am I still in the M's? Where the heck? There we go. Nightmare Steel Cage. Um, let's go with no entry. Uh, I don't know what else to add to this deck. Um, trying to think of any other cards I could add to this. Oh, let's add Shard of Greed. Or that is Shard of Greed. Where is that? And we're in the T's. Where is Shard? S-H. S-H. Shark. Shard of Greed. There we go. Okay, so... I need nine more cards. You know what? I know what I'm gonna do. Where's my Magician's Valkyria? Where are they? Uh, there's that. Magicians of Faith. Now, where's Defender the Magical Warrior? Defender, and now I need Breaker. Oops, CB, there we go. B R B R B R B R B R uh, There we go, there's Breaker. Alright there, there we go, 40 cards. Okay. Let's give this another try. I don't even know who like would have the easiest Well, I guess we'll just go with Weevil. Pendulum Achievement Deck! Let's do this. Hopefully I can hopefully I can get this. It'd be nice if I could get this. Oh, of course I lost. Of course. No, it doesn't even surprise me anymore. Which is sad. Alright, nice. Got some tension cards. Good. Give this stuff. Oh, good. Magical mallet. Nice. Okay, so how do I want to go about this? 
So, I want to look at the things in here. Hey, let's just do graceful charity first. Hold on. Okay, um... Seven, three, one. You're a three. Let me do that. And let's get no entry out of my hand. Activate shard agreed. Okay, let's go ahead and pendulum summon you there. And pendulum summon you over there. And now, can I pendulum summon? I don't know. Why can't I pendulum summon? Oh, I'm officially confused. That's good. Okay. Insector Ladybug. Good. Insector Hornet. Great. Yep. Great. Freaking. Freaking awesome, dude. I don't know how to pendulum summon. I just want this achievement. It essentially is an achievement to do this. Alright. I hope Shard agreed. Can I pendulum summon that? How do I pet? Why can't I pendulum summon? You can... Yada 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 yada. One and seven. Right? So shouldn't I be able to pendulum summon? I'm confused. I'm confused. I don't know what I did wrong. The heck did I do wrong, game? Okay. We will figure this out. We'll figure this out. <sighs> I gotta figure out how these this pendulum summoning works. Unless I... Did I not... No, I had... I don't... I'm not sure anymore, dude. And I lost again. I can't win these stupid rock, paper, scissors. I'm getting wrecked by rock, paper, scissors. Okay, so we got two Pendulum Monsters once again. Hmm, card destruction. Hmm. Stupid Flash Knight. Let's go with, uh, let's go with this thing. Um... One and one. Okay, let me place him in the pendulum zone. And now place her in the pendulum zone. Can I pendulum summon? You pendulum summon, dude! The hell is going on here? Does it have to be directly in between, I guess? Maybe I have to have a level two or three and that's it? Maybe that's it. We'll see. I've got, I bought myself some turns here to figure this out. We will, I will figure this out if it's the death of me. I'm gonna figure it out. Alright, we will end your turn so I can try to figure this out. At least I got some turns. Oh, look, another sword's refilling light, so I get another turn. Oh, bottomless trap. Okay. Great. It's a good thing I drew my other swords, because then I have now more turns to figure out what on earth I'm doing. And he just dropped. Okay, so this is a level 6. So I can't pendulum summon it. Because... Oh, you know what? I think I get it. I think I get Pendulum Summoning now. Okay, so... I think... I might be wrong, but I think I know what I'm doing. Maybe? There's a part of me like, oh, heck yeah, I know what I'm doing. And then there's part of me that's like, I don't know what the hell I'm doing. Oh my god. Can I... Okay, we're gonna surrender and I'm gonna try this again. I think I know what I'm doing, but I'm not sure. There's like a part of me that thinks I know what I'm doing, and then... I don't know, dude. It's 
confusing. Man, it's hard to keep up and be uh, be and know. Oh, synchros. Okay, and then you know we've got we've got this and we've got that and we've got all these different freaking things and freaking ways you can do different crap. Wow, can we take a second to just look at what I drew? Absolutely nothing. What is going on? You have got to be kidding me. What is that? Okay. You know what? Let's do this first. Okay. I'm going to get rid of that. And I'm going to get rid of Breaker. Do we pot of green? Oh, would you look at that? Card destruction. Once per turn. So that's five and seven. I'm not sure. We're just gonna activate this and uh, wait a minute. Wait a hot minute. Oh yeah, 5700 attack. Oh, magical mallet, thank you. I will take that. There we go. I'm gonna set her. I'm gonna use duality. If I don't figure it out this time, I'm just gonna re. Uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm just going to. I'm get on the swords. What I'm gonna do, I think, is I'm just going to look up a video on how to put pendulum summon. Okay, so there's a level two. So supposedly that's two. Now, if I pendulum it, pendulum summon seven, I can't. I still can't pendulum summon. Well, this is this is great. Um, I don't know how to pe I don't know how to pendulum summon, dude. Sure. Now, can I pendulum? Oh, I can. Yes, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Pendulum summon achievement. Chronomancer. Thank you. Finally, I still don't really get it, but hey. I don't think I can even win this duel. But screw it. We're gonna try. Yeah, I don't really think it's a feasible chance to, for, I, for me to win. So yeah, I'm just going to surrender, but there we go. We got the achievement. Whoopee. Um, so that's going to do it for that. And the next one will be... Uh, we'll probably be doing some either a pack opening or the battle pack. I'm not sure what I'm going to do yet, but I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll catch you guys then. Peace out.